any of you that have watched my channel for any length of time know that I have the digital PC 3000 um, Windows 95 box. This is a system that runs Windows 95A edition. Oh, and actually, I think it's Windows 95 OS R2. And it has a 200 megahertz original socket 7 Pentium. 128 megabytes of RAM, I believe, and two floppy drives and a CD-ROM drive. Now, those are just normal peripherals for a computer of this era. Nothing strange there. But what I will be f um, covering in this video may not be typical fare for a computer of this year. While this is a late year Windows 95 computer being built in 1997, before Windows 98, but a little bit after Windows 95's lifespan, it has an interesting feature. If we go around the back, and if I can show properly, turn some lights on. If you can see down there, which you probably can't, but get this out of the way. you'll notice something a little bit different. That white cable right there is USB. As you can see behind there, there is a USB cable. You might be going, USB? Windows 95? Are you mad? Well, okay, no, you're probably not thinking that. Um, but what you're probably thinking is that that seems a little bit weird and confusing. Well, with some fiddling and writing my own driver and messing with settings, I have been able to accomplish this. USB drive, USB port. And I can't exactly remember which port it works on. So it may take a second to get this to work. Sorry about that, the um, computer decided to be finicky. So, here we are at our Windows 95 desktop. USB drive is plugged in. And look what we have here. If I'm pointing at it. We have USB support on Windows 95. If you'd all like to see a tutorial, I can make up a tutorial. Um, but yeah, this is just one to kind of flaunt what I was able to do. Everything functions. CD drive functions, floppy functions, main hard drive functions, and we now have USB. So this has been a quick tech video by Zesty Panda. If you like this, thumbs it up. If you didn't, thumbs down. Leave comments, suggestions. Um, and yeah, that's about it. Stay tuned for more.